So I've been spending countless hours creating content and casual gaming in my studio. And so I really wanted to create a desk setup that is comfortable, functional, and at the same time, it looks good. So for this video, it will be a desk setup tailored for productivity and gaming with the brand new Secret Lab Magnus Pro XL in pure white collection. This video is sponsored by Artlist, but more on that later. If you haven't heard of Secret Lab, they're basically known for their involvement in esports, gaming chairs, and desks. So when they released their new Pure White collection, I couldn't help myself but to build one, hence this video. The Magnus Pro XL is a full metal standing desk that measures around 70 inches by 31.5 inches with three height adjustments and a maximum payload of 265 pounds, plenty enough to put all accessories that you want. Building the desk is such a breeze because everything is laid out for you to follow and the instruction manual is quite clear and simple. So the reason why I went with Secret Lab Magnus Pro standing desk is because of their well-rounded design and features. But let me tell you more about that once we finish the desk setup. After the desk is assembled, one of my favorite features is the mag pad. Basically a desk mat that covers almost the entire desk itself. It feels very nice and they offer various design on their website if you want to change the aesthetics later on. The one I have here is the silver suede, but they also offer the ash gray if you want a lighter mag pad. Adding to functionality is the Secret Lab desk riser and as well as their pure white single monitor arm with magnetic cable management for my LG 32 inch 4K monitor. The riser is perfect for desk management and it's stable enough to handle the monitor and the arm itself. Moving on with my PC, it's a custom white build. It's not the latest and greatest specs out there because I've had it for almost two years and it gets the job done. So it's running an AMD Ryzen 5900X with Gigabyte RTX 3070 Vision OC and 32 gigs of G-Skill Royal RAM. The case is the Lee & Lee O11 Dynamic Mini in white with the Corsair IQ H100i cooler and a 2TB Samsung M.2 storage. For my mouse, I opt in with the Logitech G502X wireless because I really think it feels absolutely amazing in the hands and it has enough customizable buttons for editing and gaming. For my keyboard, I opt in with aluminum mechanical keyboard from a company called Chilkey. This one is the ND75 with Gucci Miranda switches with XDA keycap and a screen on the side. I really think it's one of the best budget aluminum keyboard out there and the typing experience is just amazing. And of course, it's paired with white coiled cable. For my audio speakers, I went with the Edifier R1700BT bookshelf speakers. I believe they sound really good for general purpose and as well as audio mixing. And together, I paired it with the Kanto 6-inch stands in white to position it well and add to the general aesthetics of the setup. For my desk accessories, of course, we have to match it with the theme. And if you're interested on any of them, my affiliate links is in the description below. It doesn't cost you extra. It's just a way to support my channel. First up. I have this wireless MagSafe fast charger with a 20 watt USB Type-C adapter. Second is the concrete pan holder. Again, this one is highly rated on Amazon and I think it speaks for its quality and price. For the two small fake plants, these are sold in Amazon as a six pack. And I choose fake plants because there's no sunlight here in the basement for real plants. For the coasters, this one is sold as a pack of 12 on Amazon. They're pretty cheap, so why not? And it protects your desk from drink stains, especially if you're running white theme. I also added a notepad because I really like writing down all the things I need to do by that day and it makes me more productive and focused throughout the day. Now I also added a mini desk calendar because I saw this on Instagram and it got me inspired so might as well add it to the desk setup and at the same time I can keep track of the date and the deadlines I have to do for that month. For my monitor lamp, this one is from BenQ. It's called the Halo Light Bar and I featured this on my previous videos. 
but this one is definitely one of the best but again you can always choose a more affordable one i'm sure i'm not alone with this but i really wish they have a white version to match the setup it has a wireless control and a wireless knob to adjust the brightness and temperature it lights up from the front back and both now when it comes to video creation let me tell you about the sponsor of this video artist. Now, they're calling all video creators to make their dream project come true. Introducing the Artlist 100K Fund is back. It's an opportunity to all visionary creators to bring their wildest video idea to life. Artlist will be giving one creator the $100,000 to fully produce their winning concept, and it could be anything. It could be a music video, a commercial, a short film, or even that YouTube channel that you've been wanting to start, it's all up to you. So think outside the box. Now, this is all you have to do to apply. First, show us your $100,000 idea by posting a video on your social media showcasing your concept. The video must be 90 seconds max and it will show your creativity and vision. Second, tag artlist.io and make sure to use the hashtag artlist100kfun. Third, Go to Artless 100K Fund website and fill out the application form. Link in the description below and tell us more about yourself. Make sure to put all your heart into it. The Artless 100K Fund opens on September 24th and you can submit your idea up until October 24th. So get your ideas in as soon as you can. So head to artless.io, sign up for free, and maybe you can even use some of their assets to showcase your concept. Thanks again, Artless, for sponsoring this video. Now for my chair, I opt-in with the Secret Lab Titan Evo in black. But, there's a but, because since we're doing a white build, I also got myself a chair skin, which is the Arctic White available on their website. I really think this is such a genius idea from Secret Lab because it allows consumers or users to protect the original fabric of the chair and at the same time change the aesthetics for future proofing. The chair is absolutely comfortable to sit on for hours and I think the quality that you pay for this chair is top notch. One thing I love about this chair is it can recline from 85 to 165 degrees so I can rest in between editing or gaming plus they included a memory foam head pillow. That's nice. Now for my side lightings, I've featured this before, but these are the Govi floor lamps and they absolutely play a vital part in the aesthetics of the setup. Lighting the sides with these makes a whole lot of difference and it generally elevates the white setup even more. In addition to that, I also added a fake bamboo plant from Ikea and I believe it's a perfect match and size because it's tall and it doesn't require a ton of space to place. Lastly, for the walls, I've previously installed this before the white setup plan and these are the wooden slat panels from Wood Veneer Hub. They act as a decor with its walnut finish and a layer of felt for acoustic treatment. I choose the walnut panels because it adds contrast to the overall white setup. But I think once Wood Veneer Hub sponsor one of my videos, I would go for either the oak or the all white panels just to try it out. Now, going back to the standing desk why the Secret Lab Magnus Pro XL in pure white? Well, let me tell you. I really think that the price that you pay for this desk speaks for the quality that you get, such as the stability of this desk, the attention to details they put in producing this desk, and the essential features that you wouldn't normally get on a typical standing desk. To be precise, the fact that this standing desk is full metal, it is such a genius idea to create a lot of accessories around it and at the same time, it allows users to customize and change styles for future proofing. This includes the magpad, the very spacious cable management in the back that allows you to insert a power hub to plug all necessary accessories and at the same time hides all those cables out of sight. With the desk being full metal, you can utilize magnetic accessories such as headphone hanger, ethernet extension, cable management cover, and other accessories that you can put magnets on for easy access. And one thing that this standing desk shines on is also their integrated power outlet. So you don't have to worry about your cables getting in the way when switching from sitting to standing and it generally makes it a very clean setup. I've always wanted to create a white themed desk setup and of course it's not its final form yet but since Secret Lab just released their pure white collection I couldn't help but to try it out. And based on building this setup, it's absolutely amazing. So do let me know if I forgot something. I'll try to answer it as much as I can in the comments below. Please subscribe to my channel because there's a large portion of you that are not. Hit like for the algorithm and comment of what you think. Follow me on my social medias. And as always, 
Have a great day, stay faithful, and here are some of my videos if you wanna check my small channel. Peace out.